Namaskar to all the listeners from around the globe and a big thank you to all of you to tune into today's program of Khel Grahon Ka. I'm your host Mohit Shrimali. The topic for today's program is to dive into the world of astrology and understand from the point of view of an astrologer how the month of June 2019 looks for each of the zodiacs. What is to be expected? Where great precaution is to be practiced? What days are going to be fruitful and which days in particular are the ones where you may suffer from health problems or problems relating to your work environment? After a detailed study on YouTube channel and programs relating to astrology, I have come up with a more detailed analysis of the month where we'll be talking about the dates and time from where changes should be expected. All this will be done by analyzing the natal moon's transition from first house to the 12th of the zodiac horoscope. Now be aware, all the discussion is based on Indian standard time, that is IST. And if you are from any other part of the globe, please carry please calibrate your clocks to IST for understanding the cause and effect of the month that we will be talking about during the program and make notes of the same in your time zone. Special mention on two dates this month, a World Environment Day that falls on 5th of June and International Day of Yoga that falls on 21st June. Now without wasting any more time, let's dive right into it and explore what the month of June has to offer. Without wasting any more time, let's dive right into it and explore what the month of June has in store for us. Let's talk about Aries, the first sign in the 12 zodiacs. The time period that we will be talking about is 1st of June 2019 and the same natal moon would transition back into the first house from 27th June 2019 7:45 a.m. up to 29th of June 2019 4 p.m. Now, what does natal moon in the first house depict for you? You kickstart your month with great travels, praises, good health, good times. This day is marked for weekend travel. Happy times with family and friends are ahead. A reward if you say for the hard work that you have put into the previous days. For my friends in corporate sector, target meetings and performance reviews are going to be a breeze. You are going to be appreciated for your work. A good day to plan your investments and move forward. For those trying to light up the old spark this is the day. A weekend getaway is sure to set you free from hustle and bustle of the city life. Natal Moon in the second house. The time period we'll be talking about is from 2nd of June 2019, 6:45 a.m. onwards, up to 4th of June 2019, 11:40 a.m. The same transition would take place back in the second house from 29th of June 2019, 4 p.m. onwards up to 1st of July 2019, 8.55 p.m. The natal moon in the second house, what does it depict for you? As for all the good things that have to come to an end, so does the jolly times. Be ready for a short day of leg pulling, humiliation and non-cooperation from your peers. After all, in the last phase of natal moon, you may have been announced the star performer. A few keen eyes wouldn't take it so well, but always remember, it's just a phase. Within no time, it will pass. Today what seems impossible, tomorrow it will be attainable. Worries will surround you regarding the future course of action and your plans put forward for the investments. Refrain yourself from arguments, fights, as it will cause domestic disturbance. Other than that, have a sound sleep. Tomorrow is a new day, a new beginning, and you can't imagine the way that it will turn up for you. Natal Moon and Third House. The time period we will be talking about is from 4th of June 2019, 11.40 a.m. up to 6th of June 2019, 2.50 p.m. Today is all about success, achievements, happiness, positivity and great energy. A sound sleep relaxes you to take on the day with stride. For all the nagging and leg pulling, this is your day to show why you are the best. With great confidence and head held high, you could close deals, achieve targets. This day will be full of energy for you. Siblings, friends, relatives, show support. Domestic disturbances will fade. Your attempts towards your goal will seem sure-footed and attainable. Try giving your partner a little relief. Cook for them. Go out. Dine. 
your happiness and energy needs to be shared with people around you natal moon in fourth house time period we are talking about is from 6th of june 2019 to 50 pm up to 8th of june 2019 5:25 pm natal moon in fourth house hinders progress first of all drive safe follow road rules keep your eyes peeled on the road a small mistake can cause a domino effect for bad That means an accident may be just around the corner if precaution isn't practiced. It may result in vehicle damage, self-injury and injury to others on road. I don't need to explain this point any further as I believe all you listening to this episode get the seriousness of the issue. This time period may cause anxiety, panic and restlessness due to which you may experience surge in blood pressure and stress levels. Relatives from maternal side can also cause problem or disturbance in your household. Take special care of your health, especially chest and digestive tracts. Play cautiously with money. Restrain yourself from pulling out or making investments today. Natal moon in fifth house. The time period we are talking about is from 8th of June 2019, 5:25 p.m. up to 10th of June 2019, 8 p.m. Remember digestive tracts problem I told you about in the transition of moon in the fourth house? Yes, that risk is still around. If you're not going to take care of it on time take special care before it gets to a stage where treatment is unavoidable you may feel demotivated and unappreciated remember this is not going to last matching expectations is hard especially for a person whom the seniors and peers count on and you are one of them remember try putting your best foot forward and not get agitated by constant questionings in this period it is better for you to take a step back and reevaluate the scenario and your future course of action natal moon in 6th house the time period we are talking about is from 10th of june 2019 8 pm onwards up to 12th of june 2019 11:25 pm remember the investments that you did in the first phase check on them timely it is a right time to reinvest and reap what you have sowed health wise your trajectory has shown major fluxes from past few weeks and recovery period is thus ahead and special care is to be taken however the na- natal moon in the 6th house from the native's house exhibits progress and good health financial gains jovial moments rekindled spark in life and many more however caution must be taken when getting involved with the opposite sex as for any troubles that may surround you overall a good time to enjoy with your partner financial gains health recovery and success this day Natal moon in 7th house. Time period is from 12th of June 2019 11:25 p.m. up to 15th June 2019 4 a.m. This day is marked with positivity all around, unhindered progress and uninterrupted bundles of happiness. In this period, expansion of your social circle, especially in the opposite gender, is foreseen. If you have been planning to purchase a movable or immovable asset for a long time, This is the time to move ahead on this plan and make favorable dealings for the acquisition of the same. With the same, any investors listening to this program may also invest in their dream projects and update their investment portfolios. This period is also favorable to traders and people in marketing. Natal moon in 8th house. The time period we are speaking of is from 15th of June 2019, 4 a.m. onwards up to 17th of June 2019 10:45 a.m. The weekend doesn't seem to be any good this time of the month. Health problems surround you. Stress, anxiety, aggression, pointless disputes, depression and disagreement. Even so, accidents due to careless driving may cloud you this weekend. If you're in the habit of consuming alcohol, try refraining from it and try staying sober, hydrated and eat healthy. Drive cautiously. The mantra for this weekend is to forgive and forget easily. If any conference is scheduled for the weekend, rather that be a teleconference, a video conference or a urgent meeting in office, try to stay calm and composed. It may feel exaggerating, but prevention has always been better than the cure. Natal moon in house 9. The time period we are speaking about is from 17th of June 2019 10:45 a.m. up to 19th of June 2019 8 p.m. It would seem like the dark clouds won't leave your side. 
constant self doubt and body pain especially in hips thigh and leg region is foreseen a little ruffle with children is possible remember no fight is worth the relation that you have with your children learn to agree to disagree mostly during a heated conversation people speak things that they don't mean and later they ponder upon it rather a good solution to your problem is to let the dust settle and then put up your point be careful of office politics giving a small amount of time to god will bring peace and prosperity it calms you down and reenergizes you with new hope and clear vision possible you will also get involved in some charity work natal moon in 10th house time period from 19th of june 2019 8 pm up to 22nd of june 2019 8 am remember praying is always helpful when solution to your problems can't be found leaning towards god will always give clarity and courage the feeling is surreal today new energy and feeling of being blessed like you could take over the world lately a promotion is due if you had been expecting one this is the time you may receive but remember with promotion comes responsibility and authority use it carefully appreciations are in order from superiors if you had been planning to set up your own business it is a good time to do so too thus due to the professional trips around the globe are also a foreseen your little circle of most interested friends and family members are in full agreement and support of you a good period for wealth accumulation and rise in name and fame natal moon in 11th house time period from 22nd june 2019 8 am onwards up to 24th of june 2019 8:20 pm this period signifies coming over people causing you trouble your enemies people who don't want good to happen to you and this also signifies end to petty issues in your personal life overall this period foretells increase in income accumulation of profits good company and gathering of friends and family this period also signifies replenishing lost energy and collection of amount loaned out to people always remember the credit to your success always goes to people around you and to you in the last a individual is evaluated by the company he keeps his interests and the way he treats the less fortunate always remember to appreciate the women in your life try giving this a thought and on this note let's move to the 12th house natal moon in 12th house time period from 24th of june 2019 8:20 pm up to 27th of june 2019 7:45 am have a tab on your expenses try to spend moderately this doesn't mean you shouldn't enjoy a cozy spa weekend or a shopping spree but remember to do so responsibly with your budget in mind as this period suggests loss in income and investments the natal moon in 12th house brings forth headaches fluctuations in finance trouble in domestic life scuffles here and there increase in stress due to aforesaid situations is therefore foretold try to be in your lane Don't try any unethical move in business or in the office. You will have to pay for it dearly. And mark my words on this. Try making out this period as quietly as possible. 